it feels really real. Sometimes it gets scary when you know that people's lives are actually in your hands and it makes you think, think like you don't want to make a mistake because someone can literally die because of something you did or something you did not do. But when I joined the military and I went to school for respiratory therapists, it became obvious I'll be dealing with people's lives. Now at this point, it was mainly my fellow soldiers. You know, I, it was more like, if anything happens downrange, I can take care of fellow soldiers, but never thought I would have to like actually take care of Americans, Americans, you know, like we're doing right now with COVID-19. This, this is actually something really good to feel about because you're part of the team that has just helped this person to go back home. You know, you've contributed to their survival, you've contributed to them being able to walk out of the center alive. It's, it's rewarding, you know. The, you may not like show it and be like, oh yeah, I did this, but um, a feeling at the end of the day is just like, oh wow, I was actually part of that thing. I made it happen for that person. Now they, can, they get to see their family again. Now they get to be able to do the things they want to do because you're part of those that took care of them. So yeah, I'll say it's rewarding. At that point in time when you're doing it, you probably not feel it, but when you step out of that role and you see people going out, you're like, I was part of that, yeah. Feels good. You know, it was never something that I ever thought about that I would be a soldier, but there is something about me, what I want to do, I always want to do. You know, even if everyone says, no, you can't do it. So when I told my husband I was going to join, he goes, you can't even run. I'm like, don't worry about that. He's like, you're so thin, like you'll be broken up. I'm like, don't worry about it. I want to be in the military and I'm going to do it. And so it, at that point in time, it was um, a dream of mine. And I'm happy and grateful that um, I had the opportunity to do it, you know. I am Sergeant Omaladi Babalala with the 801st Bravo Company out of Indianapolis. And I'm originally from Nigeria, West Africa. Thank you.